everyone. So as many of you know, if you saw my post, I got to go to the Tribeca Film Festival this past Saturday and see the premiere of season six, episode eight. Now, I will not be discussing anything about the episode, so no spoilers here, and I won't discuss anything about it until it officially airs on July 11th, but I just wanted to share the photos that I took at the event and talk a little bit about my experience of the event. And again, I won't be discussing the episode at all, so if that's what you're looking for, sorry, you're going to have to wait. Um, so this was a very last minute decision to go. I was very jealous of everyone going, and um, I was really afraid also of being spoiled. Also, I just decided, like, when else am I going to get this opportunity? It's my favorite show. It's the final season. Um, why not? Why not go? It was open to the general public. It was, uh, again, being screened as part of the Tribeca Film Festival. So it was held at one of the BMCC campuses, the Bureau of Manhattan Community College, uh, which is part of the CUNY, which is the City University of New York system in um, in Tribeca off of uh, Chambers Street, for those of you familiar with New York. So they had us line up outside and it was uh, general admission. So it was kind of first come first serve. Like once you got in, they handed you a yellow ticket after they scanned your ticket. And um, those yellow tickets that they gave us had our seat numbers on it. So they were assigned once we got in. But um, so we lined up and I got there a little early and I'm glad I did. I Again, I, I just wanted to like see where the theater was and get an idea of it. Um, so uh, we, we walked there from our house, our hotel, we weren't staying too far away and we got into this line and they had it, um, sort of, uh, fenced off and, uh, up at the front, you can see that there's like a little red carpet area there. And so they let us in, I want to say it was like around four that they let us in and the show started around five. Um, and once we got in to this like little, like area um they had uh the tribeca film festival like wallpaper um you know like where they would have the talent stand to take their photos they had lights up above angled down at that area and that part was uh fenced off and there was a row of photographers and videographers in the front and um everyone else just like everyone else in attendance was allowed into that area and we were just waiting there and then um as the talent arrived uh, they stopped and they were photographed and and filmed um they did interviews and i want to say that happened for i don't know about an, an hour maybe 45 minutes again like my sense of time isn't the greatest it was really i was really excited to be there i wasn't checking my watch or anything um but the first to arrive was ray seahorn and then um, Peter Gould, and then um, Gordon Smith, uh, Bob Odenkirk, and then finally uh, Tony Dalton. And so each of them stopped and they had their pictures taken, they were interviewed, and they were walking up and down. It was really loud. Um, as you can imagine, there were a lot of people. So it was everyone like in attendance, like standing behind the, the fence. And then you had all the... Um, the the videographers up at the front so I couldn't really hear anything that was being said even though I was like right at the front it was just so loud but I did get some clips I just I didn't include the sound because it just sounds like a lot of noise it just sounds like a lot of people talking which is what it was so they did that and then we got moved into the theater and I took some photos some shots of what it looked like inside of the theater just so you guys could get a sense of what it looked like and then um as people filled in towards uh as we got closer to showtime there were some seats in the center that had been reserved. And then that's when, um, you know, uh, Peter, Bob, Ray, Tony and Gordon came in. And I'm assuming also their guests or people maybe associated with the show. I imagine probably some folks from AMC and maybe Sony were there as well in the center. And so they took their seats, which was so cool that they were just sitting there with us. Um, I was sitting next to a couple of uh, women. Shout out to Justine. And uh, Justine mentioned that she's been to a couple of these types of events and she's never seen that before where the talent sits among the audience for, for one of these types of events. So I thought that was really, really cool. And then at the beginning, they showed a bunch of like previews for like other um, film festival events. They had that old timey cartoon where it was like, let's all go to the lobby and get our ourselves a snack and then there was a disclaimer at the beginning um, warning us not to record or share any part or reproduce any part of the episode we were about to be shown and then then the episode uh, began and then um, after the cold open as the titles were playing 
uh, the audience erupted in applause and cheers. And I thought that was really, really cool. Now, a bunch of people have asked me what it was like to be there. And it is probably everything that you imagined it, it would be to be there. It was really exciting. It was thrilling to see it on the big screen. It was thrilling to be among other super fans. Um, everyone that was in attendance was was obviously a big fan of the show. And it was personally the best film going experience I've ever had. And I mean, the people behind me weren't, you know, talking about what they were going to go to after or where they were going to eat dinner. I didn't see any cell phones out or anything like that. I mean, it was dead silent as the episode played, except for when we collectively reacted to the scenes we were shown. So I'm not going to talk about what those reactions were, but um, it was just really cool. It was a really cool, immersive experience to be a part of. And then after the episode ended, um, they went up on stage for a uh, for a Q&A with the moderator. They did not take any questions from the audience. It was just the moderator asking questions. And that was really great. And again, I'm not going to share anything about what they said because uh, obviously they were talking a lot about the episode and I don't want to spoil anything. So I'll have a lot to say about both the episode and the panel discussion after July 11th when the episode officially airs but it was really cool it was really cool uh, uh, it was so cool i'm yeah what an experience what a thrilling experience to be there so yeah i hope you enjoyed my photos and um yeah i'll see you guys in the next one